All right, folks. Welcome back. You're here with the Dragon from Dragon Works. And we're back on the 2005 Big Dog Chopper. If you don't know what I'm talking about, back up and catch the previous couple videos. But where I left you off, uh, I just rebuilt the carb, flushed the fuel tank, fuel lines, pet cock, and I threw a battery in it and I was going to fire the thing up see how it ran if it needed any jetting or tuning or what have you and then proceed with the other uh tasks that i have here but uh what i did was i ended up it was pretty quick uh diagnosis here <laughs> um you got a hot wire going right to this ehc module and nothing on the bike work so bingo that's where we're at um did a bunch of researching and after Researching it and coming up with all kinds of different things. I just cut to the chase and I got a hold of Tim out there, big dog. And basically it's pretty pretty much some of the same thing I read online. They got a new uh rip um unit that's kind of like a it's a Gen 2 rip unit or something. It's supposed to be pretty much plug and play where you take the new harness, plug it into your old harness, and then into the new HC, um, H, bleh, EHC unit. I knew I'd get that out. It's Monday morning. Give me a break. <laughs> anyway, uh, then, then we should be good to go on it and get this thing fired up. I know folks been waiting to hear it. I've been waiting to hear it too. This is going to be one sweet sounding machine. We all know that. But when I was talking to Tim, he said that right now they're, they're a week back ordered so then after that, then it'll be another week for delivery. So it could be up to two weeks before we get it. But I'm going to keep working on it slightly. I got the tire to put on some other things to do. We may be holding off on the detailing because of the uh, much added expense. These units are very expensive. <laughs> so uh, he may end up just cleaning up himself, uh, not paying so uh, we might not be doing that. I was really hoping that we could. I know that sounds crazy, but I love polishing metal and cleaning bikes up. It's something I like to do. And uh, I guess it relaxes me and I can think when I'm doing it. It's therapeutic. So I actually uh, was looking forward to it. No, I don't want to do yours for free. <laughs> but um, anyway, I also working back on that uh, 81 FLH. Got some things resolved on that. So I'm back working on that. I'll be doing that while I'm waiting on the parts, but just thought I'd give you a little update on what's going on here with the chopper. And uh, I got another chopper right next to me. I got to get some situations solved there too, but uh, we'll talk about that another time. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned because uh, here in a week or two, we will have this thing fired up and running. Take her for a little spin. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Peace out.